Harvard scientists say that these UFOs could be time travelers. Now, across decades and cultures, witnesses keep describing the same thing. We are alone and we should stay on Earth and there is nothing else to go. We will go through extinction. I mean, the Earth will become a desert, just like Mars. Small humanoid beings with big heads, big eyes, and barely any hair. It's weirdly consistent, but here's where it gets wild. Those exact traits, that's us or at least what scientists say that we might evolve into. There's this growing theory that so-called aliens weren't actually aliens at all. They're extra tempestrials, future humans, time traveling back to study their past. And look, the evidence is stranger than you think. First, their obsession with nuclear weapons. UFO sightings just so happen to skyrocket right after we developed the bomb in the 1940s, and they keep showing up at missile sites, in some cases, shutting them down. So if these visitors are our descendants, I would say, of course they're gonna be worried. We're playing with the tech that could alter or erase their timeline. And look, their tech is clearly advanced. It looks like something that we could build in a few thousand years. David Gresh even said that their propulsion system feels like a natural evolution of ours, just on a different track. So here's where it gets serious. Harvard researchers actually included this theory in a 2024 academic paper. They called these beings extratempestrial cryptoterrestrials, future humans in hiding. That's no longer fringe science. General relativity allows for closed time-like curves, paths through space-time that could enable time travel. The equations check out. The technology? Maybe not yet. But do you think somebody eventually cracked it? Maybe the reason these aliens seem so familiar is because they are. Maybe we've been searching the stars for answers when the real mystery is in our own reflection. And I often wonder, and sometimes even hope, are they here to save us?